The little squirrel took a hard fall onto my deck. Mom is still up here inside, thumping around. There's another baby here, but he looks like he's passed away. So I, I know let's see if mom does something with him. Oh, that guest's coming soon. Baby, will you just start making some noise? I don't want to touch the dead one. No one's dead? Yeah. Yeah, I think he hit his head off the uh, thing there. This one looks oh, like no, it's... Oh, he's breathing. He just took a breath. Did he? Yeah. Okay. This one ha is bleeding from his mouth, it looks like. I want to lead her away from here, so I want to like, take them maybe down here where she can still hear them. Oh, he looks dead. No, he just took a breath. Hey, baby. Can I help you? I'm so sorry. Yeah, you are alive. What? Cry for your mom. That's good. Okay. Yeah. Well, come on, mom. I will get out of your, I'll put them out of your way so you can come get them. Like this. And you're not bringing them back up there. I'm so tired of squirrels costing me thousands of dollars. There. So today, my electrician is over trying to fix the light in the living room. And while he was shop vacuuming, down came a thud. Little tiny babies. They're still alive. Not doing that well, though. I've moved them away from the porch where they were living because um, they were crying I was hoping that their mom would or her mom their mom came in this direction so I was hoping that she would hear them cry and come and take them somewhere else anyway so those are baby squirrels I've moved them into a shady spot and hopefully she can find them and the spot where the squirrels were living is over on the other side where Brian is uh taking apart my deck. Okay, talk to you later. This guy's got some fight in him. There you go, baby. Cry for your mom. I want you to cry for your mom. Oh, you poor thing. Your mouth probably hurts. And you. Come on. Come on. Come on, baby. Make lots of noise so your mom finds you. I'll take this big stick out. They're on the washcloth that's soaked in milk right now. Hmm. Okay. Well, I hope that that helped and I'll be back in a couple hours. We'll do it over again. You'll get used to it. So I just fed them with the eyedropper and it worked. The first one, who's on the bottom, didn't like it very much, but I got some milk into him. The one on top took to the eyedropper and sawed it out, took it into his mouth and sucked out the milk, so <coughs> that seemed to go well. Now we've got a greco roman roll it. Hey, hey, get your feet out of your eyes. We've got a uh, greco roman roll wrestling match going on here. I'm not going to interfere with them, but I wish they would 
get comfortable. You've been fed now. You feel better? Do you have some more energy you can ca call for your mom? Here's the milk and the dropper. The dropper is tiny. Let's see how we do here. Anybody? I want the bottom one to look for it. There, that one's that, that one's taking it. Okay. You want it? You want it? Okay. Leave you alone, you got quite a bit. Okay.